Hello everyone. Welcome back to another video. Today we are going to talk about one of the most hot topics in the field of artificial intelligence. Project QSTAR by OpenAI. If you haven't heard of it yet, then you are at the right place. Project QSTAR is a visionary initiative that strives to create a quantum artificial intelligence system that can surpass human intelligence in all domains. Sound crazy, right? Well, not so much if you consider the amazing achievements of OpenAI so far. Let me give you a brief overview of what OpenAI is before we dive into Project QSTAR. OpenAI is a research organization that was founded in 2015 by a group of tech players such as Elon Musk, Reid Hoffman and others. Their mission is to ensure that artificial intelligence is aligned with human values and can be used for the benefit of humanity. OpenAI has been developing and releasing cutting-edge artificial intelligence models and products such as GPT-4, DALI, ChatGPT and more. Now QSTAR is basically an algorithm that is capable of solving basic mathematical problems by itself. Some AI researchers believe that QSTAR is a combination of A-STAR and Q-learning that can achieve flawless accuracy in mathematical calculations. Most artificial intelligence models today are good at writing and translating because they are trained to perform a specific task just like chat GBT. However, solving mathematical problems with only one solution shows that QSTAR's reasoning capability works like human intelligence. Project QSTAR is so advanced and powerful that even it can predict future events to some extent. Not only that, QSTAR will be able to generate new ideas and solve problems even before they happen. Many people believe that QSTAR is so big that it became the reason for the removal of OpenAI CEO Sam Altman. Even Elon Musk said that this kind of super intelligence can be a game changer when it comes. According to Reuters, Project QSTAR is a significant step towards the much anticipated AGI Artificial General Intelligence also known as Artificial Super Intelligence. AGI is a highly advanced form of artificial intelligence that is trying to replicate the way humans can do, think and learn. Imagine a computer program that not only does specific tasks like translating languages or playing games but also figures out entirely new tasks on its own just like a person does. AGI would be smart enough to know when it doesn't know something and then go out and learn by itself. It could even change its own programming to better match what happens in the real world. Basically, AGI is about creating a machine that can do any intellectual job a human can and adopt and learn as flexible as we do. However, no other company has officially discussed working on AGI, but reports suggest that Amazon may be in the race. Now the potential impact of Project QSTAR is immense. If successful, it could lead to breakthroughs in how we interact with technology, automate processes and solve some of the world's most critical issues. However, this technological innovation also triggered some fears among OpenAI staff members who felt that company did not have enough safeguards in place to commercialize such an advanced AI model. They see it as a threat to humanity because they think QSTAR could enable AI to make decisions or actions that are beyond human control. Another reason is that its advanced capabilities could also lead to possible misuse. If it falls in the wrong hands, an AI of this magnitude could spell doom for humanity. Okay, so in conclusion, Project QSTAR remains shrouded in mystery because it is still in its early stages. It may soon emerge from the shadows, revealing new possibilities and setting new standards in the field of artificial intelligence. Microsoft, which is a big investor in OpenAI, also seems to have a share in the development of QSTAR. However, no official statement has been made by OpenAI about QSTAR. Alright, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you really did, please share it with your friends and leave a comment below. I would love to hear your thoughts and opinions on Project QSTAR. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you in the next video.